Hey guys, what's up? This is Lasercorn from Mahalo Video Games, and we've got a game between LZ Gamer and Versed here today from the MLG. Whoa, look at this. Two drones just hanging out there, not mining minerals. And this is from the MLG 2010 in Dallas. You guys uh, hit up that video a lot, the last LZ Gamer video I put up, so I'm gonna take that as a sign that you like him and think he's awesome, which he is, and I'm gonna post more videos of him. So that's how we run this thing here at Mahalo Video Games. Burst, uh, I think might be new on the MLG scene. I haven't heard of him yet. Feel free to correct me if I'm wrong in the comments. If he's some awesome player that I just kind of didn't see yet, that's fine too. I mean, I'm sure he's awesome to make it to the MLG. I'm just saying. I personally haven't seen any games of him yet. And it looks like we got these scouts coming out now. Uh, we've got the SCV coming into the base of Burst. Gonna mix it up with those drones there or run away. Probably the better move. Up here, we've got the drone scoping out LZ Gamer's base. Probably knows a wall off is coming, judging from that one supply depot over by the ramp. And uh-oh, look down here, we've got an engineering bay going up at the natural. Bad news for Verse. Verse spots it. Is he gonna bring in some drones to try and get rid of this SCV? That would be the clutch play at this point, I think. But <laughs> that engineering bay is already at 700 health, so it doesn't even really matter. He's gonna have to try and knock that down before he can take his expansion. Spawning pool, pool coming up in the back of the base here for Verse. Gas going down. Looks like a gas going down for LZ Gamer, too. And LZ Gamer kind of sitting out here with a probe and a half finished engineering bay. Hmm. And it looks like Burst is going to try and pump out a queen and a couple Zerglings to go knock this engineering bay down. We do see the uh, rally point set to the engineering bay, so he wants to get rid of that. Orbital Command now coming out for LZ Gamer. And that wall off is done. This Marine gonna hunt down the drone that's been wandering around the base of LZ Gamer. Get that drone out of there. The drone running away. And the Marine losing him, apparently. Oh, there we go. Get back in there, Marine. Meanwhile, down here, oh, the Zerglings take down the engineering bay. And now, Verse can throw up that expansion. LZ Gamer pumping another Marine. And a factory coming out for LZ Gamer. So, one barracks and one factory. We could be seeing a 1 1 1 opening. Destiny Cloudfist. Destiny Cloudfist, by the way, trademarked by H to the Husky Husky. I don't know if that's what we're going to be seeing. Oh, yeah, and there's the starport. There we go. This very versatile opening. Could get Medvax or Hellions. Well, it doesn't look like he's going to get Hellions, but allows for a lot of versatility. And this Zergling going to come check out this ramp. He's just kind of hanging out at the bottom of it. And those Marines moving in, they don't like the Zergling hanging out on the ramp. Another supply depot going down. And I like the way Verse kind of has some units here to pick off anyone that tries to wander out of the base of LZ Gamer. And here they come. But it looks like they're only going to come out far enough to kill that Zergling. And they're going to go right back in. And now they're going after this Overlord. They will be able to pop this Overlord. He's sacrificing himself to get in here. And he is going to see the two starports both building uh, tech labs. Uh-oh. Are we going to see Banshees out of LZ Gamer? Banshees or Ravens? Maybe one of each. Meanwhile, down at Burst Base, he's got a queen trying to get this SCV out of there. That SCV trying to get some scouting info. Roach Warren is up. Evolution Chamber going up. 
And he's on his way to layer tech. This factory is gonna lift off here. And oh no, we do have two banshees coming out. Oh, two banshees and cloak on the way coming out of these starports. And wow, if you've been following the last few pro games I've casted with Terran, you know I was always disappointed that no one ever gets cloak on the banshees. So now we are gonna see cloaked banshees come out. And that's gonna be trouble because I don't see, I don't think, oh no, there is gonna be an overseer on the field. Oh no, now those cloaked banshees won't be able to do as much harass. So that overseer is morphing in. Maybe these banshees can get here and pick off some. Oh, they're going after that creep tumor. They should be going after the uh, drones down here. Is Cloak finished researching? No, you can see it's not quite done yet. But two banshees, too much for one queen anyway. Queen goes down. And a second and third queen here. He's going to have to micro these banshees. Get that ba her banshee out of there. And now this banshee trying to go one-on-one -on -one with the queen. And it should be able to be successful. If it is successful, this will be a three queen takedown off of two banshees. Excellent play by LZ Gamer. And it looks like he is going to be healing up that injured banshee. Drones going down now, left and right. This banshee's up to seven kills. He's a corporal, but here come the Hydralis. Boom, that banshee knocked out of the sky. Cloak is done. Cloak is done for these banshees. But there is an overseer out here somewhere. I don't know where he is, but I saw him morphing in. Where's that overseer? Hmm. Well, I don't know where that overseer is, but it's out there somewhere. These banshees getting repaired up. Meanwhile, LZ Gamer gonna use that distraction to probably try and take his natural here. Well, no, I'm sorry. He's gonna morph into a orbital command first, and then he's gonna move out to the natural. There's only one Zergling guarding it, and <laughs> a bunker going down by LZ Gamer. He clearly didn't see that one Zergling. And uh-oh, here come the Banshees, five of them. Five Banshees moving out across the field. This is scary. This is bad news for Verst if he does not have the Hydras and Overseer combo. But there's the Overseer, where are the Hydras? There are the Hydras, and these Banshees are in serious trouble. They need to get out of here, those Hydras do a lot of damage. And good move. They need to either group together and attack or just back off. Two Hydras left. The uh, Banshees can actually take two Hydras, two more on the production tab. So a little failure of positioning there by LZ Gamer. If he had grouped those together, that would have been uh, that would have gone in LZ Gamer's fa favor, I think. And look, a Changeling on the field. Changeling going down, and he dies a horrible death. Banshee's on the field now. Here they go. He's scanning and taking out uh, those creep tumors. Interesting strategy, trying to receive the creep. I might have gone for the uh, drones, and that is too many hydralists for these Banshees to deal with. They need to definitely retreat. What do we got on the way? Oh, look at this, though. But they lure the Hydras out of range of the Overseer, cloak, and then they go to work. And look at those Banshees taking down those Hydras. Those Hydras cannot defend themselves. Well, there's the Overseer. They can, but there's not enough of them now. And here we go. We're going to see the Banshees fight the Hydras. And the Hydras look like they were winning, but no. The Banshees in control of the situation. And, uh-oh. These drones are in trouble now. The Queen should have been out there helping those Hydras. I guess, uh, I guess first thing realize what was going on. Time to get the queen out there. And all these drones are going to go down. And this is big, big trouble for Verse. Now going to work on the hatchery. He needs to save this hatchery to stay in this game. Where are the Hydralists? There are the Hydralists. Just spawning out of there now. All these Banshees are going to go down. And, wow, it's a good thing he hung on to that expansion. Oh, and look at this. Hellion's coming in now. Oh, my goodness. Taking down all those Hydralists. Wow. And now, skirting past the Queens and into the base, those Blue Flame Hellions doing a lot of damage. And not to the Queens, but to the Hydras. And if he can get into that uh, drone line and kill the drones here. Oh my goodness, he lost all his drones at his natural, bursted, and now he's going to lose all his drones at his main. 
I don't see how we can come back from this. This is a massacre. Look at these flaming drones everywhere. And now Vikings coming in to pick off the overlords. Those Hellions just ignoring the heavier units, not even bothering to finish off that roach. They just want to kill all the drones. And look at, if we look at the income, yes, uh, Verse income is slowed to a crawl. He has been crippled by this Hellion Banshee harass. What excellent play from LZ Gamer. And now hiding in this corridor in Zelnaga Cavern. And look at this. It looks like he's coming in to finish the job. Hellion Banshee build. <laughs> Verse joking around saying, Psh, that's it. But that is all it will take to destroy you. I assure you that. Oh, look at all these Hellions coming in now. And Blue Flame going to work. These are the incorrect units to be using on Roaches and Queens. But there's just so many of them. <laughs> Jesus says Verse. That's so many Hellions. A ridiculous number. Plus, he's got the Banshee backing him up. And first calls GG. Wow. That was an interesting game. Hey guys, what's up? This is LaserCoin. I just want to remind you to subscribe, comment, and rate these videos. Also, if you have any requests for videos you want to see or just want to say what's up, send that over to requests at mahalo.com. All right. Thanks a lot, guys.